it's your boy John from here. Welcome in you back to another episode of the Saga Lock. Hopefully everything is going all right and fine and dandy. Um, we are out here. Like I said, it's episode 25. Woo! Um, like I said, sorry for the late episode today. Um, on top of the fact that it's out on a Wednesday instead of a um, Thursday or a Tuesday, because I had to prioritize my finals, get all that set up. I had a uh, 9 to 12 page paper about the critical analysis of Frankenstein. But let's get into this. Our Pokemon that we had as our choices were Drowsy, Cubone, and... Um, our Drowsy, Marowak, and Magneton. Y'all, uh, the voting total was 8 to 5 to 1. Originally, Drowsy had the lead 5 to 1. And then... Marowak just came bustling through and was like, boy, let me get here. It's the cage lock partner. So yeah, y'all chose freaking amazing Marowak. And I'm actually really happy that I can select it and grab it. Um, and the game doesn't break because I added the other two mods that are on our squad. Of course, we got to name it Aaron. It's literally the cage lock partner. If I did not name it Aaron, I would literally be dead. So yeah, so Aaron, our Marowak. Uh, I'm going to be interested to see what he has as Pokemon, hopefully, or moves. Hopefully, it's pretty good. We got Elm's phone number. Uh, hashtag hype. Um, but, yeah. So, let's see what our team is packing with. We've got Tarant B, and Aaron is holding an item. Item. Take. It's TM. Thank God. Okay. So, we have... Oh, my God. We got Earthquake and... Let's go! Let's go! Earthquake on our starter! Yeah! Okay, we got Boomerang, Earthquake, Thrash, and Growth. Worth set. Yeah! Aaron's gonna die in five episodes, but that's fine. It's, it's, it's basically guaranteed to happen now. Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah, we have... <laughs> Earthquake and growth. Oh my gosh. Like, we have to have that setup. I'm going to use Aaron, actually. I'm going to switch and put Aaron in the front and see what I can do. Because our team is looking pretty nice. I don't know why Mew looks like Mr. Mime. Like, I don't understand the point of that. That makes absolutely no sense in my head. But if that's what <laughs> Game Freak decided to do, that's what they decided to do. I know it's usually reflective upon the typings. So, oh my god, we can get a Mega first route. Let's go! Oh, we can get an actual mega first route potentially. This is awesome! Hopefully that's what we get as our first encounter on the route. Oh my god. This is hype. This is actually hype. Okay. What well we get to find out what's on the route so that we can catch as well. Um oh my god, it's the common encounter! Yes! Yes! It's the common encounter! Yes! Oh my god. Finally! Is it time to have a Mega in an actual solo series? I think it's time. I think it's time. Oh my gosh. That's... <laughs> this is high. Jota... Okay. I was not expecting Jota to be this hype already. Not even gonna lie. I talk about how much I'm like very met on it on Johto, and then game goes, oh, by the way, I'm actually gonna be a god for you. Please don't give me Pokeballs. Please don't give me Pokeballs. Yeah, I think you just give me the map stupid thing. Good, okay. Pokeballs aren't received until after I get, like, all the way up here. So this is another route, too. It's bad because it doesn't tell you the routes still. Like, it still falters on that front, but I guess that's what it has to do. Um, the second route has Magby. Oh no, we're gonna have an issue, fi a fire issue where we run into a bunch of fire types. I really hope not, but it kind of seems like a plausibility. Um, but anyway, like I said, uh, today's episode is going out a day late because I've had to finish my finals, um, for my, uh, English class. So, I actually still have one more thing I have to do for English, and English is done afterwards. Which is kind of crazy to think that English class is basically done. Because all I have left for English class is an annotated bibliography. Which is basically the work cited page, but explained. Literally, that's what it is. That's literally what my teacher said. I was like, well, I can't we just... Why did it have to be separate assignments? 
because they could have done an annotated bibliography within the, the paper, but whatever, they're separate assignments, so I literally just write three sentences about why I, each, why I used which source, why, and it's like, okay. Seems like a very dumb thing to do, but okay, makes sense. I mean, it's 10 free points, I guess, and I'll take 10 free points. Um, especially because that's the one class I don't have an A in. Um, and then after that, I have some... Oh, it's David! Oh my god. Oh, I literally talked to Toronto about having this! Oh my god. Why? This is too high. This is freaking... It's not supposed to be. And you guys are going to ask me how much caffeine I had. I literally only had this coffee that I made myself. What the... This is stuck! What? Oh my god. Ah! This is so stacked! Why is it so stacked? I don't have Pokemon yet, so it doesn't matter. Oh my god! What is this game? There's a It's so stacked! Oh my god! Now, Clamp is not broken any- Wait, is it? Oh, Clamp is still broken. Great. Wow, I'm gonna lose my voice today. Apparently, that's the route we're going. Um, but wow, th this is just busted. Like, I definitely should use B um, for attacking. Because B doesn't have, or actually, Mew might actually be the best as far as attackers go. Oh, that's right, we get an egg. But we get the egg we give to Elm. Oh, there's Oak. Oh my god, you are the Kanto champion. I can't believe it. Like, I need you to go through Johto now. I see you kept B and Tyrant. They're like amazing. What happened to your starter? Did it just like completely get annihilated? No, it it did. And I don't want to talk about it, Oak. I don't care. I loved Timmy, okay? I love Timmy, okay? Timmy is amazing, and he was supposed to get more crits, and then he died prematurely to a freaking explosion by Koga. Don't talk to me, Oak, okay? Same with you, Elm. I have a uh, hatred to you. No, I don't. Elm is actually just one of those per like professors that's like, trying to figure out a good way to explain it. <laughs> that <coughs> seems like the very nerdy type. Um, M, like, I know that I don't do voices. Oh, please don't give me that. <sighs> That's the first encounter that I've been like, eh. And Magmi. There, so there's a couple good encounters on this route, though, that we can get. But yeah, no. I want to keep this Aaron alive. I think I can. I believe that I can keep Aaron alive considerably. Um, but it's definitely not an easy task. We still don't have Pokeballs, which is perfect. Like a heal. And then we know that uh, our arrival is going to carry this drowsy slash hypno throughout the game. So you guys get to see, you guys still get to see the drowsy slash hypno. So that's cool. At least you guys get to see the drowsy and hypno pair. Um, but uh, we haven't named, oh, we got to name our arrival. Who are we naming our arrival? Oh my god. I have no idea. I kind of wish I could name the Gen 3 rival, but I can't. Uh, this is Gen 2. Okay, question mark, question mark, said, how the drowsy. So yeah, so this is the second, the thing he voted for secondly. As you can see, there's still a 15% level boost. So, uh, even with the 15% level boost, I want to say that Lance is still under 60, which is really sad. Oh, Foresight? Oof. You are oofy. Oh, Future Sight. Even worse. Even worse. Um, okay. Oh, I turned it off. Sorry. I got a message from Aaron, and I totally did not mean to turn it off. What level is Lance from Dragonite? What level is Lance in Pokemon Silver? Oh, my God. Yes, Arby. Tell me. Oh, my God. 42, 44, 46... 47. His ace is 50. 50 times 1.15. 1.15 is 
the, eighth, the champion's level is 57, which is not bad, but that's only because we have a 15% level boost. Literally, the only reason why it's even comparable is because our level boost is so big. Like, we're going to see that discrepancy throughout the entirety of uh, the games, and we're going to be like, bruh, okay, so Steven's out here in the mid-60s, and Lance be level 50. Like, it's bad. But anyway, we're going to go deliver the mystery egg. We're going to get the five Pokeballs. It'll be all fine and dandy. We get to name our rival. We're going to name our rival. Huh. I don't know. Because this is like one of the weird... It's weird because it's like one of the few rivals you get to name. Because Generation 3, you can't name them. And then... Generation 4, you can. 5, you can't. 6, you can't. 7, you can't. Wow! What? You can't even name your... Oh my god. You just... That's a weird revelation that I just made. That you can only name your rivals in 3 of the 8 generations. That's an oof. Okay. Okay, I know this is a boy... But I'm naming it Joy, which I know is kind of coy, but just, I can't find another word that I want. Oh, talk to Elm, talk to Elm, get the Pokeballs. You almost forgot to get them. I always forget that you have to talk to Elm, and it's just like, oh yeah, that's right, you have to do that, that's a thing. Wait, what am I doing with my mom? Oh no, he's the dude that gives me the Pokeball. Oh wait, is it only a Pokeball? No, 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 no. Please tell me he did not just give me one Pokeball to start my Nuzlocke. Boy, if you give me only one Pokeball to start my Nuzlocke, you're gonna be in a world of hurt, okay? You better not have just done that. No, okay, we got five. Whew! He was gonna be in a world of hurt. Um, I guess we talk to our mom and tell her that we're going on an adventure, technically. Do you want me to save your money? Heck no! No, 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 no. I've had some experiences with that in real life, and that's not gonna happen, okay? I'm not letting that happen in a game when in real life that stupid stuff has happened to me. Anyway, uh, this is not randomized, so yeah, I skipped right over it. So our first encounter, because we're going to get it, is hopefully Charmeleon, hopefully Charmeleon, hopefully Charmeleon! Yeah! Okay, we gotta catch this. If we don't catch this, then freaking, uh, I'm gonna get uh, a Mega Charizard really upset with me. I don't have any other way to, like, make it do well, though. Oh, my God. You fire blast already. Okay. I have one potion, though, so it's okay. <clears throat> I've got one potion that does eight damage. A crit does 16. We're fine. Hopefully, we get the pair out, but I don't know if we will. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> I thought that would do way more. Okay. We're fine. Everything. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and throw our first Pokeball because we can. And actually, I might go into B because B's more tanky. Oh, that sucks. Uh, do I go into B because of how much more tanky B is? Or do I go into Aaron because Aaron's physical? Oh, no, Aaron. Oh, wait, special defense exists in this game. That's right. Okay, so special defense matters now. Um,. Let's look at the stats then. Let's see who's technically better, statistically. Uh, 13 and 13. Oh no, Mew's technically better still. Okay. Uh, I'm still gonna heal. Because I cannot lose Tarot early. There's just, it's if I do that, that's bad. I want it to hyper beam. If I can get it to continue hyper beaming, then I'll be happy. Uh, but what's scary is that this Charmander or this Charizard has so many broken moves already. 
Uh, but I really need this to catch. Come on, Mega. Come on, Mega. Game Boy Luke. Mm, it's shaking three times. Come on. I need this. I really do. I need this, Charmeleon. I love you. Charmeleon, I love you. Oh, God. Hyper Blast. Or Fire Blast. Does eight. Which means a crit still. But the first roll was... Oh, no, the first roll was 8-2. I just can't count. Okay, we're fine. Just Hyper Beam, please. Or catch. Game Boy Luke. Yes! We got an actual Mega! Let's go! Oh, we got the real Mega! That's the title of this episode, by the way. So, everybody's gonna know I got this. But... I don't care because it's the real freaking Mega and that's what matters and Mega's gonna be so happy because we never freaking catch this and the fact that we did is astronomically lucky because we never do it. Oh my god, I can't believe we did it. Yes! Uh, and we're actually, <laughs> we're actually almost at the end of the episode, which is kind of say it, but like also true. Um, I want to get, <sighs> do, do I get the one encounter? Because we could. Oh, you don't even heal me? You freaking... Bruh. Mom doesn't even heal you in this game. Uh, I mean, I guess that's probably because Elm does. To be fair, I believe Elm literally has a thingy my bomber. Yeah. <laughs> like, I was like, I think Elm literally has the thing that we need, but... You know, we can complain about mom not having it. It's fine. Um, actually, what I'm thinking about is that because I forgot the introductory to this game is a lot longer, I am gonna probably I am going to um, walk over to the air area that we want to go to um, and end the episode where we are because honestly, this is a great spot. Next episode, we will be going towards the first area um, of the game, Violet City. And it's just kind of crazy to think that this is where we are already. I am so glad we didn't get that. We already have a really good team that I'm really excited about using. Um, and hopefully we just blast through this game. I think we can. Um, our episodes are really short, so like it does make a difference. But yeah, hopefully you guys have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. I love you all. I gotta get to work on some of my final assignments for other classes. Love you all so much. Keep up the amazing work you all do every single day. Peace. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe too, because I need it.